go. Good morning, guys. I know it's been a while since I've had another video out. I've been extremely busy. It's been a hard year 2020 has for all of us. But uh, hopefully, I'm back to fishing. Should be putting out more videos. This video I actually started a couple of days ago. We decided we were going to run down to the lake, had a few hours. We just had a big snow come through, had a white Christmas, hadn't had that in years here in East Tennessee. Couldn't tell you the last time, so that was awesome. But it got the water extremely cold, and the water levels have been fluctuating in the lake, so it just had to fish shut down. We decided to go to a pond and try fishing for a little bit and got into a few fish. And this morning, we got up early, I'm headed to meet my uncle. We're gonna go back to the pond and try to do a little fish and see if we can't catch a few more. It's about 40 degrees this morning. There's a beautiful sunrise just coming up over the hill. So uh, stick with me. I appreciate everybody that subscribed to my channel. I look forward to making a whole lot more videos for you guys in the near future. Thanks for watching. God bless you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are down here on Douglas Lake today. I'm gonna try to catch you some crappie. It's a balmy, what is it now, 36 degrees. Snow on the ground, December 27th. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, we... Yeah. It's my first time fishing this spot. Boy, that's wild. He's after that thing hard. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> he about had him, right? Hard. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> he about had him, right? Yeah. Wow. Uh. Folks, we are at location number two. Come back here in the mountains on a private pond. It wasn't happening at the lake for us, so we figured we'd try this out for a while. About to get dark, but we got a few minutes of fishing we can get in. Is she? Well, Look, there's fish jumping all over there in the corner. You ever see that over there? There's fish. Yeah, there's fish. There's something rising over there. Probably don't need fish too deep here, do There's fish over there. I don't know where it is, but something's working.
Okay, so I'm kind of looking. Can't get him to work. Hey, fish on. All right. There we go. Finally, it's a crappie. Yeah, it's not a big one. It's just a little feller. But hey, we'll take it. Just throw him back. Super cold out here. But man, is it not beautiful? I mean, look at this. Golly, it's just beautiful out here. Now that crappie, he hit super, super slow. Like, I didn't even feel the hit. I just felt a little bit of weight on the end of the line, set the hook. There's one. There's one. We've got another one, Rick. It's another small one. Nothing right home about, but man, I'll tell you, as slow as fishing's been and as cold as it is out here, I will take it. Okay, there's another one. Fish number three. Oh man, he came off. Lost him. I'm on him here. I just hooked another one and lost him. Oh, there he is. Got that one. Number three. They're hitting that red with a yellow head there. That's a, it's another small one. I think he's about the biggest one yet, but he's still a little. There we go. Bring the with the flies. I brought this one for me. <laughs> no, they've been. I've had I had that one tip with a minnow. So. I think she gives us more than three does. It looks like it. At least they're hitting. We're catching something. I they yeah, they. It wasn't happening at the lake. Ladies and gentlemen, it was just, it was like the Dead Sea out there today. Of 
quick battery change. Back in business. Any more hits? Huh? Uh, about a foot and a half. Two foot. Maybe, maybe just a little bit shallower. Not much. There you go. There's one. Rick just got one. He hit red too, didn't he? Pink. Pink. I'm getting all mine on the red. Now, folks, when you're fishing for crappie, a lot of times they just don't take the floater straight under. You have to keep a close eye on it. It'll start swimming off to the side with it. When you see that, reel up and set the hook. Cause you got a fish. Like that. Oh, like that right there. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, I believe that's about the biggest one yet right there. I hadn't hit the white one, believe it or not. First hit I've had on the white. All right, let's get back out there. Tell you what, it's just good to be out fishing. It's been so long. I've not had a, a video out in, golly, probably over two months. Y'all probably done thought I kicked the bucket or something. But uh, I'm still here, I'm still going, I'm still fishing. Hope to put out some more videos soon. Just uh, had a lot going on. But I'm back and ready to do some fishing. Here we go. See if we can't get the old crappie to hit today. There he is. Golly. A little one. Normally we wouldn't keep them this little, but we're going to do a little stalking. You 
Yeah, you have a flavor Yeah, I actually I got another one in my pocket here. My coat pocket, I believe you. Yeah. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Oh, golly, there's one. He wasn't playing around. He just took her straight down. Oh, you got one, too? All right. That there hit the white one. Well, you got a bluegill. Oh, well, I just lost mine. Fell off in the pond. Got some slab happy lures there. Made by some local fellas. You ever use those slab happies? I've caught some pretty good crappie off of them. And white bass. No, I don't know what to get. They uh, sell them down there at Bucks and Bass. I know they got them there. Mm-hmm. Let's see. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Got that one. This feels like a little bit better fish here, Rick. It's a little bit better fish. I think it's a bass. Yeah, I got a large mouth. All right, look at that. It's a nice little surprise. Not a bad little large mouth. Let's let him go. See you later, buddy. <sighs> there we go. Let's try that spot. Oh, Rick's got another one down there. Another crappie. Yep. There he is. There he is. It's another little crappie. Yeah. <laughs>